Hi, this is Dash with a quick introductory video to movement in Windborne. This is aimed at getting you up to speed with some of the basic yet vital controls. Movement. The basic movement controls are as follows. W for forward, A for left, S for backwards, D to move right and space to jump. Hotkeys. Escape gives you the main menu. Q is to open your inventory, something we'll expand on soon. C is the crafting guide where you can combine mats to make things. Actions. E. This is for opening chests or furnaces and using them, or as something as simple as clicking a sheep to interact with it. This is actually pretty cool. Right click your mouse and hold to gather. Here's an example where I'm going to make some stairs whilst holding right click. It seems the value of the block depends on how long it takes to pick it up, as you can see when I start to dig further down. Now left clicking your mouse will place an item. As you can see you have the ability to place several blocks away as long as it can be highlighted. Shaping terrain. By holding down shift and right clicking the mouse you can lower terrain. By holding shift and left clicking the mouse you can raise terrain. You can also smooth terrain by holding middle mouse button down. Now changing objects works much the same as shaping terrain. Hold shift plus right click will change an object to its next state. Here's a great example on a tree branch. Holding shift plus left clicking terrain will change it back to its previous state. Pressing R will rotate it and finally pressing middle mouse button will auto fit it to the neighboring object. Inventory management. Inventory management is surprisingly straightforward. Press Q to open inventory. Now let's use the left mouse button to pick up a stack of grass from the action bar and drop it in our inventory. If I right click this stack, it will be sent back to the action bar. If I press control left click, I can half this item stack. If I press the shift left click, it will pick up one unit of the item stack. By clicking the middle mouse button on the stack, it'll drop it on the ground. Thanks for watching. Be sure to like and subscribe to stay on top of the best tips and how to's for Windborne. Bye for now.